Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm sharing four different hairstyles that you can do with just your flat iron. The flat iron I'm featuring in today's video is the Lumabella Keratin Dual Touch Styler. This flat iron features keratin micro conditioners infused in the ceramic plates that help create a healthy shine to your hair without any oily residue. And when you have dry hair like mine, you know that adding that healthy shine is a must. It also has this really cool innovative heat sensor technology that avoids excessive heat on the hair, which helps to protect your hair from more heat damage. It detects damaged or dry areas of hair and automatically adjusts to a personalized heat setting for your hair. So there's less damage and less breakage. I don't know about you, but I am just blown away by the technology that goes into today's flat irons. It's pretty crazy, right? If you want to check out the Keratin Dual Touch Styler from Lumabella, I will leave a link in the description box for you guys to check out. So let's start with the first hairstyle, which is straight hair. And I think we all know this hairstyle already, but I'm still going to share it anyways with you guys. So my natural hair texture is not straight and not curly, it's just sort of like a little bit wavy, but mainly a whole lot of frizzy. So that's why whenever I style my hair, I always have to take a flat iron to my hair to eliminate the frizz. And since my hair is thick, I have to work in sections like this. Look at the difference already between these two sides, right? So this flat iron starts at 300 degrees Fahrenheit and goes all the way up to 450 degrees Fahrenheit. Fine hair would want to stay on the lower end of the heat temperatures and thick, difficult to straighten hair like mine would want to go higher. I kept mine at 450 degrees, but like I mentioned in the beginning of this video, it has a heat sensor and adjusts the heat according to the dryness and damage of each strand of hair. When I was using this, I noticed it changed between 450 and 430 degrees for my hair. So that's it for this first hairstyle. This is my favorite way to wear my hair day to day. Hairstyle number two is the windblown hair. This hairstyle features a slight curl to the hair, but nothing super defined. This is a super easy everyday kind of hairstyle just to give some life to stick straight hair. Again, I like to work in sections and this time I'm taking pieces of hair and clamping my flat iron down about halfway and then slightly twisting my flat iron back and dragging it down. I go pretty quickly through each section, that way we get almost like this lazy looking curl. The slower you drag your flat iron through your hair, the more defined the curl will look. So I'm just going to continue this same process all throughout my hair, not really touching the roots of my hair with the flat iron and just keeping most of the heat on the bottom half of my hair. Here's what this hairstyle looks like. And again, I think it's a nice subtle curl and looks like you put effort into your look, but it was also super quick to do. That way it can easily be an everyday hairstyle you can rock. Hairstyle number three is actually one of my favorites, which is the wavy crimped hair. I don't care what people say, I will always love a good crimped hairstyle. This works amazing if you have shorter hair too because back when I was growing out my pixie haircut and curls weren't an option for my hair, I was able to still give my hair texture with this crimping technique. So as you can see, I'm taking a small section of hair and going down my hair but making sharp angles back and forth to create this jagged crimped effect. In the beginning, it won't look that impressive, but once you complete this hairstyle, the overall look is to die for. I love these waves in my hair, and you can definitely achieve a heatless version of this, but if you're short on time, this is the perfect solution. It only took me 15 minutes to achieve this hairstyle. Actually, all these hairstyles in this video took 15 minutes or less to create. This hairstyle looks so good on its own, but I can't help but always want to pull out my flower crowns when I have wavy hair like this. It's just perfection in my eyes. <laughs> so now moving on to the final hairstyle you can do with your flat iron. We are creating big curly hair. This I would do for like special events and occasions and things like that. Um, maybe like a holiday party coming up. So it's similar to the windblown hair we did earlier, but this time we are starting the curls closer to the root and going through each strand of hair slower to create that definition in the curl. So grab a section of hair and clamp your flat iron down and then twist your flat iron back. You'll know you're doing it right if you have this little tail sticking out of your flat iron like this. 
If you have layers in your hair, this is going to create big voluminous curls in your hair. You can definitely control how curly you want your hair by how slow or fast you drag your flat iron through your hair. And you can 100% create Shirley Temple kind of curls if you go like super, super slow, but for today's video, we're just gonna do regular curls because I feel like that's what most people would wanna wear. So that is it for this final hairstyle and that completes this video. I hope you guys enjoyed and learned something new. Huge thank you to Luma Bella for sponsoring this video. I had a lot of fun trying out the Keratin Dual Touch Styler and creating these four different hairstyles for you guys. If you want to check out Luma Bella, again, I will leave a link in the description box for you guys to check out. Thanks so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed and if you want a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel, I wouldn't mind that at all. I upload every Monday, Wednesday, Friday and Saturday, so I will see you guys then. Bye!